6 a memorial is growing on the spot of a deadly crash in a normally quiet Charlotte neighborhood. For the crash happened just before 2.30 Sunday morning along Colville Road in the Eastover neighborhood. Fox 46's Jamal Goss spoke to the father of one of the victims on how he's remembering his son. Memories continue among friends who knew Robert Walker and Henry Melvin. Police say Walker was driving a Mercedes Benz at a high rate of speed on Colville Road this weekend and may have been impaired when he ran off the road, hitting and uprooting this tree. Police say the car caught fire and two other passengers went to the hospital with serious injuries. Melvin and Walker died on the scene, both in their 20s. They didn't deserve this because if you ask anybody how to describe them, they were just genuinely happy and kind. Alex was one of their friends who showed up to lay flowers at the site. It's where a makeshift memorial is growing. Dozens of people have placed things like cards and letters to remember them by. Others stop to take pictures and pray while drivers pass by slowly. Fox 46 was there when Melvin's father visited the memorial. Off camera, he says he will miss his son dearly and his heart goes out to the other families. We all love them so much and they're never going to be forgotten. They're always going to be watching over us. As cleanup crews removed the debris left behind, parts of the car remain on the scene. Neighbors say they're heartbroken by what has happened, but it's not uncommon that speeding was a factor. Meantime, heartfelt messages like this continue to grow at the memorial. They were friends to so many and impacted the lives of so many. And <laughs> um, there's no other word to put it except that we're all just extremely heartbroken. And right now, police are waiting on a toxicology report to see if alcohol may have been a factor. We're also waiting to hear on the condition of the other two passengers who were involved. In Charlotte, I'm Jamal Goss, Fox 46.